this is it. Winner takes all. Maze of Memories or Amazing Defenders. Dork's just gonna stand there? Or do you think you can act like men for a change? I'll show you a dork. Check out these bad boys. Carefree, Rocket Warrior, and Guild for the Lightning. I play XYZ Dragon Cannon, Blade Knight, and Kaiser Seahorse. I'll add Beast Freak Art, Black Luster Soldier, Buster Blader, and Valkyria. What is happening, my Yugi dudes? All right, the box battle of the century. We got Amazing Memories. We got Amazing Defenders. One thing that has not yet happened, that's happened for Amazing Defenders, but not Maze of Memories, is that we have we do have a collector's rare from Amazing Defenders, albeit it was pulled from a blister. But hopefully today we'll get lucky and we'll get one, maybe two collector's rares. Of course, give this video a big old thumbs up. Let me know that you like it. Make sure that you're a public subscriber and hit that notification bell for max notifications for our videos do come out. And of course, leave a comment and let me know before we even start, are we going to get a collector's rare here today? With that being said, let's go ahead and crack into the first box. All right, cracking this thing open. And you know what? We're calling the audible. We're going to open up both boxes right now. Instead of doing one at a time, we're going to do a couple packs at a time. So we're going to open up both. Do the customary pack shuffle even though technically these sets should not be mapped we are your hashtag no mark no mark packs show of record so we don't want any uh, mark packs I don't want any mark packs near to you and also you know I do enjoy shuffling it just makes me feel better to know that uh, I, I've at least done my due diligence uh, in both of these sets no mark packs. It's what we it's what we preach on the channel. It is your no mark packs show of record, not even close. And we're gonna shuffle up Maze of Memories first. Yeah, so th this is gonna be a little bit of a longer video because yeah, we're doing two boxes at the same time. And uh, oh, you, that's what she said. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, we're doing two boxes at the same time. And uh, Seeing if uh, we can't pull ourselves a collector's rare from one or e or both boxes. Uh, my hope is at least one collector's rare, and not to say that you know I'm rooting against uh, amazing defenders, but we have pulled a collector's rare from there already. So my hope is that we finally get a collector's rare from uh, or sorry, we've gotten a collector's rare from amazing defenders, but we don't have one from Maze of Memories. And I'm hoping that we can pull one from Maze Memories just so I can at least get one Collector's Rare from that set. Uh, so, gonna do a couple more shuffles. Actually, this one, and do this last little shuffle in the back end. Move some of those packs from the front to the back. And both boxes. Oh, let me get this uh, Maze of Memories box set up better. Because it decided to shift everything. All right, both are set, and because a, a Maze of Memories, I think was the uh, the the last winner. We're gonna go with Amazing Defenders. Oh, you know what? Actually, I don't know if I've done a, a battle between uh, Maze of Memories and Amazing Defenders. You know what? Thinking about it, I don't know off the top of my head. That actually uh, is kind of frustrating. My memory is 100% going. And uh, I think, you know what, that kind of sucks. Good thing I have these videos to go back and uh, to look at, but we've already started, so we're gonna have to, you know, I'm a, ooh, we got our first hit. I'm gonna have to go back, uh, look, but obviously while we're rec recording, uh, I don't, I, I really can't recall if I've done a Amazing Memories versus Amazing Defenders, like a blister thing. I definitely know Tactical Masters with Amazing Defenders. All right, the first pool we got is Alerts is the first ultra rare for this set. Uh, eh, not one of the better ones, but that's okay. Uh, since we pulled an ultra rare, you know, we're gonna move on to Maze of Memories. See what we can pull from this set. Uh, definitely uh, 
you know, we've got a couple of um, the ooh, Ancient Fairy Dragon, always nice to see. Got a couple Solemn Judgments from that set, so uh, definitely digging that. Probably get at least one more here today. Ooh, we got our first hit. Let's see what we got, and we got, yo, XL Synchro, Stardust Dragon. We have not pulled this one yet. That is a pretty epic pull, and right behind it is the Song of Thunder. Let's freaking go. Get this thing sleeved up right now. You know what, while we're at it, I didn't sleeve up alert, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. All right, both are sleeved up. Oh, we got the Excel Synchron, or Synchro Stardust Dragon, so. That is a pretty epic pool for Maze of Memories. So, a lot to uh, catch up on for uh, Amazing Defenders. Not not uh, the most solid start. So we're gonna go back to Amazing Defenders since we now have that ultra rare from both sets. Again, hopefully one, we pull a, a collector's rare from one of these sets. And then hopefully for uh, Maze of Memories, um, what haven't I pulled yet? Oh, you know what? Oh, man. man. It's highly unlikely because we pulled the Excel Synchron, but not impossible to pull the Barone. That would be a pretty epic pull if we were able to get the Barone here today. Um, at least for uh, Amazing Defenders, we got the Card Trooper. Um, you know, I, I meant to look and I didn't, but Hidden Armory, I can't recall if it did get a, a Collector's Rare print. Um, ooh, we got our next hit. What do we got? And we got Mc, uh, McConco Water Arabesque. Oh man, definitely not one of the uh, the better pulls from this set. Uh, but we'll take it. We got two Ultra Rares already for uh, Amazing Defenders. Not really the hottest ones for the set, but you know, anything can happen. The uh, We could still pull a Collector's Rare and that'll definitely uh, Set it over the top uh, for, against uh, a maze, uh, maze of memories, but who knows? If we get a collector's rare maze of memories, then that's pretty much game over as far as. Ooh, we got. Oh man, we got our next hit. I moved everything up front, and then we got wind up. Oh, wind up kitten. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, definitely not one of the better ones for. Maze of Memories, my goodness, I can't believe it. We got Collector's Rare, or uh, uh, both, or two Ultra Rares on each set already. And we still got like a lot of packs to go through, so. Hopefully, that means either one or two things. Uh, either we're gonna know really quick that we don't got anything, or we put that Collector's Rare in the back. Hopefully. That's the case. We, we got a collector's rare in the back of the box. So, let's see if we can't bring that to fruition. Call it into existence. I'm super pumped. Let's freaking go. Oh, we got our next hit. Uh, and we got ourselves. We got the rescue. Uh, wait, okay. Rescue, okay. I was, I was like, man, did I pull another one? The first one was alert, so. My goodness, Maze of, or Amazing Defenders, the three Ultra Rares up front. So, we're going back to Maze of Memories. My goodness, I can't believe it. Hopefully, what that means is that, oh, we got our next hit for Maze of Memories. Did I shuffle these like really wrong or, oh man. Go, oh, Black Luster Soldier, Legendary Swordsman. Oh man, but it looks like there's some um, uh, name, like they didn't, uh, let's see if I can't get it good. Yeah, the, some of the name is not on there, like where it says Legendary, like you can see some of it is missing. But golly, okay, we, we, have, we have a situation here. Okay, so we got all three Ultra Rares from both sets already. So, oh man, that is absolutely wild. I can't believe that's happened. What could happen here today is we pull a collector's rare because we moved everything to the front. And we'll know that right off the bat if any rare card is in the third slot. If we get a rare card in the third slot, we know right off the bat that we got ourselves a collector's rare. 
And hopefully that is the case. And we are witnessing history here today in that we got a collector's rare on both sets. That would be pretty darn epic. And you know what? For the channel, I think that's something we want to see here today. We are your collector's rare show of record. Uh, not even close. We pull collector's rares quite a few times on the channel. Definitely more than anything else um, as far as like big hits. Yeah, I've, I pulled a couple of Starlight rares, but the amount of collector's rares that I pulled is uh, pretty epic. And uh, definitely excited uh, for collector's rares. Uh, I really like them. Um, but I'll, uh, I will say, if there is, you know, and those that have been with the channel for a while, uh, I think y'all uh, heard me say quite a few times about my... my uh, order of uh, collect or um, rarities that, that I'm a fan of uh, on top is the ultimate rare that is hands down my favorite uh, rarity for the Yu-Gi-Oh um, next is the ghost rare uh, golly I really really enjoy ghost rares um, and then uh, after that I think uh, I think most people would uh, be surprised to know that secret rare actually is uh, the next one. I really love secret rares. And yeah, I put secret rares above a starlight rare. Um, but, you know, just because I see more secret rares than I do starlight rares, um, which makes sense because, you know, every uh, core set does come with two secret rares. And so, you know, and then you got sets like Brothers of Legend, Battles of Legend, um, that, uh, just have uh, secret rares in every single pack so I, I love seeing secret rares and then right after that uh, starlight rare just because of how you know how uh, glittery it is or you know I like the referring as as frosty you know like secret rares they're they're frosty and so I really uh, enjoy the way they look um, and you know what I'm gonna start going towards maze of memories because I'm getting a little tired of Amazing Defenders, and maybe we'll get lucky and pull a Collector's Rare on this side. Let's see if we can't make that happen. Mech Knight, okay, the Ancient Fairy Dragon. Um, but right after Starlight, I do like my Collector's Rares, for sure. Um, and then right after that, I actually really like the Gold Rares. I, I really do like uh, the Gold Rares. Uh, overlay Network for the next Super Rare. Man, if this is it... Uh, man, Maze of Memories definitely uh, did a number on Amazing Defenders and did it like right off the bat with that, that Excel Synchro pool. Oh man, I, I hope there's at least one more epic pool uh, from one or both sets. Uh, maybe we'll, we'll get even more lucky and maybe this is an error box and we'll get a uh, another uh, ultra rare. That would be pretty fantastic too. Hopefully, uh, one of those options is the case, and we're not just going through uh, ultra rare or seeker or golly, getting uh, all caught up. That we're not just getting uh, super rares from here on out. That might kind of uh, dud the video for a lot of folks. So hopefully that's not the case. I mean, yeah, we still got the Excel Synchro, which is pretty fantastic. Um, definitely one of the better cards. Uh, not. Uh, probably not getting that Barone, uh, at least maybe not in this video. Uh, again, if we got an error box, you know, I'll, I'll take it, especially if it came with a Barone. That would be pretty epic. I mean, it's actually, you know, if we do get a Barone, the, the more likely case is that it won't come in a in an ultra rare, but it'll come in a collector's rare. And you know what? I wouldn't be upset about that. Not at all. I think that'd be pretty fantastic to get a collector's rare Barone. Uh, again, I don't own a Barone in my collection at all. Never pulled it from Synchro Storm, so uh, being able to pull one would definitely be awesome for the collection. Uh, for this, it would. Ooh, there's our first Psalm Judgment. Like I said, probably end up pulling two of them. Gotta love that card. And then the card that's very difficult to pronounce. Uh, I'm not gonna try it. Not today. Uh, I make I make a fool of myself enough with uh, other things I do, so definitely not gonna do that here 
today. Uh, let's see. Trying to hopefully salvage and, and potentially try to pull a, a collector's rare. That would definitely uh, cap off one or both of these sets if we can get a collector's rare. Let's freaking go. And again, we'll know right off the bat if we do pull a collector's rare. We're going to do one more pack and then we're going to move back over to Amazing Defenders. And then uh, do a little bit more back and forth. Because not getting much on the Maze of Memory side. Okay. Moving back over to Amazing Defenders. We're going to do a couple packs. And then we'll go back to Maze of Memories. Try not to stay on one set for too long. But. <gasps> oh! Oh! Ah! This is it. This is should be a collector's rare and we got X Berlin Noir collector's rare. Let's go, your collector's rare show of record. I can't believe it. We called it into existence. I said, if it was gonna happen, oh man, that it would happen. That one of these sets is gonna come a collector's rare. And thank God it finally happened. I would have been so sad if we went through the rest of these sets and uh, only stuck with the three ultra rares this early. Okay, we're gonna do a couple more of uh, Amazing Defenders. Golly! We now have two collector's rares from Amazing Defenders. Neither of them are duplicates. Let's freaking go. Oh man, I, yeah, I, I do love collector's rares, you know, just because, you know, the, 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 uh, the, the reflective, uh, you know, beauty of the card. You know, they 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 uh, put it all over the borders and stuff like that. So I really do it, and it does have, uh, you know, I think a little bit, not a lot, because it's not really, you know, much of a stamp like you would see on an ultra rare or an ultimate rare. But it does have that that you know look that there there is a uh, a print like an imprint on it like you would see in a collector's rare, so. Okay, last few, uh, couple packs more of Amazing Defenders, or sorry, Maze of Memories. Maze of Memories, Amazing Defenders, golly, they're just so close to each other and how they're pronounced, at least I think I am. So it's kind of uh, tongue twisting me just a little bit. Man, Ancient Fairy Dragon. That would have been a pretty, you know what, we're gonna, that would have been a pretty uh, collector's rare, but you know, they made a lot of uh, epic ones already in the set. You know, we're gonna finish Amazing Defenders because if there's anything left for Maze of Memories, you know what, I'd rather not pull it yet with uh, plenty of packs left. Oh, Expertly Noir, we pulled another one. Um, rather uh, save those packs for the end not because we at least unless we got an error box again I'll take an error box I definitely won't complain about that but um, if that's the case you know, we're gonna find out really quick but hopefully in maze of memories we did what we did for amazing defenders where we moved the collector's rare to the back and the ultra rares were up front so last pack for amazing defenders not expecting much because we already got the Ultras, and we got the Collector's Rare. But if we do got something, it's going to be right here. And we end for one for one on the Amazing Defenders. Okay, last few packs of... Oh my goodness, and this is inside the sealed box. Golly. Hopefully, with Maze of Memories, we get a Collector's Rare. And like I said, that would... Oh man, that would be pretty epic. But we did get Excel Synchro, which is a pretty epic card. Usually when you get a high-end card like that for a set, it is unlikely to get a collector's rare. Again, not impossible, just unlikely. Whereas, you know, the ultra rares that we pulled for Amazing Defenders, eh, not that great. So I feel like it makes sense that we pulled the collector's rare. Heavy Labyrinth Tank. At least that's how I feel uh, when it comes to these sets. Uh, you're it's unlikely that you're gonna get a collector's rare when there is uh, higher end cards in the set. Mark gets set 
duel. That's actually kind of cool. We got two packs left. Come on. Call that into existence. That collector's rare. I know we can do it here today. We pulled one. Let's see if we can't get a second one. Gate Guardian and Gate Guardian and Water and Thunder. Okay. Last pack magic. Can we make it happen here today? We've gotten one collector's rare. Let's see if we can't get lucky and pull a second one. We're going to do a little bit of a card trick because we know that the collector's rare would be right here and the super rare would be right here. Make sure we don't look because we don't want to know if we got ourselves a collector's rare. And if you haven't already, hit that like button for good luck. We got the Imperial Iron Wall. We got Blue or Angel of Blue Tears, Performer Pal Duelist, Extraordinaire. We got the Nimble Angler. Okay, we got the Labyrinth Wall. And, oh no, did I already spoil it? Oh no. Oh man, I can't believe I messed it up. Oh, that sucks, but yeah. We only got one Collector's Rare, but you know what? I can't complain. This was by far a pretty epic battle. Getting that Excel Synchro for uh, Maze of Memories definitely made it difficult for uh, Amazing Defenders, but golly, did we get ourselves a Collector's Rare here today, which to me, I think both sets won. I don't know about you, so. Of course, leave it in the comment, let me know which set you thought won here today, but I think I put good money that uh, pulling a Collector's Rare does put a set on top. With that being said, I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day wherever you may be. And I will catch you all later. Out. Collector's Rare! Toriental Tribute! Blue Eyes White Dragon! Let's go! And then, Ultimate Rare for Bidden Droplet. We'll, we'll, we'll chat after this. Starlight Access Go Tucker! The end! Yo! Right at the end! Last yo, pack. yo, yo, yo! Last what? Pack. Okay, well, well, let me look at these. Let me look at these.